Police in Mombasa this morning netted 400 rolls of bang at Bondeni bus terminal. The illicit substance is said to have been ferried from Nairobi on transit to Lamu. Kisauni OCPD Julius Wanjohi said that the owner had declared the parcel to the bus operators as tomatoes. But the bus crew became suspicious following a strong smell from the cargo, prompting them to alert the police. The suspect was arrested and taken to Bondeni police station. Elsewhere in Nyeri, emotions ran high as the son of Solicitor General Wanjuki Mushemi was laid to rest in Tetu district. The bereaved father revealed that his son was assaulted elsewhere but managed to get to their house in Loresho where he succumbed to internal head injuries. The emotional father, who at one time broke down into tears at the government to hasten investigations to unravel the mystery behind his son's death. Among the mourners who attended included top government officials, led by Special Programs Minister Esther Murungi, who read President Kibaki's tribute, describing him as friendly and an outgoing person. Still in Nyeri County, Central Provincial Commissioner Kiplimo Rugut has warned that the outlawed Mungiki sect was emerging in the area ahead of the March 4th general election. The PC has however assured residents that the government will remain vigilant and deal with any members of the sect out to cause mayhem. He was speaking during the ground opening ceremony of Nyeri Campus Ugandan-based Fairland University. The new institution is expected to accommodate about 10,000 students and will offer courses mainly in agriculture, education, accountancy and business studies when fully fledged. The project is an initiative of the director of Braidgate Poultry Industries, Dr. Thuo Madenge, who is also aspiring for governorship position in Nyeri County. Brenda Cheriot, Citizen Weekend.